Welcome to the prologue of Cyberpunk TC. Together we'll be going over the setting, the rules, and of course the players. Timestamps below if you're wanting to skip ahead, and be sure to check out the shorts that will give a bit more of a rundown on what you're going to see. TC, short for Transcendent City, is the location of our little game. Unlike most of the world, TC is independent of corporate rule. Well, mega corporate anyway. Thanks to the cabal of littler corporations working together to limit their influence. This city is comprised of the Ascent, the upper city where the wealthy and corrupt lay, the hollows where most of its population and gangs reside, and the barrens, the edge of the city and home of the nomads and untouchables. Emphasis on untouchables. This game will be a bit different and unique, especially if you're a fan of our other series. Players have one life to live. When they die, they're gone for good. And more than that, players have separate sessions, acting out their own wills and lives, only encountering each other if their paths should happen to cross. And yeah, that means a player or two might die without ever even having met another one. Yeah, that'd be a lonely world, huh? Now, as for our players, Zach is Ludwig Grimes, the CEO of Akuma Industries, a cyberware manufacturer. Rich, corrupt, and powerful, he's sure to play a grand part in what's to come. Travis is Alex Shade, the man of mystery. Due to events he himself isn't aware of, his memory is lost. He wakes in an alley, but the only thing he remembers being his name and the basic structure of the city, he's trying to figure out who he is, for better or worse. Gary is Ken Regan, a TCPD detective who refuses to embrace cyberware. Trying to be one of the few good cops in the force, he begins one hell of a struggle with his humanity. Victor is Gregory Geiger, a ripper doc who has fallen from grace after failing to save Virgo, the son of the chief of Maxtac. Trying to survive while maintaining his family's life, he is about to encounter more than he bargained for. Last, but certainly not least, Squiggle is Chuck Murray, a cab driver for Voltaic Motors. His family has left him behind, so he drives the streets hoping to find a way back into their good graces. Now he readies himself for what might be the last ride of his life. Hopefully you've enjoyed this. Be sure to check out our shorts. There's a Patreon where you can give direct support and even access to some behind-the-scenes content. That does it for me. Oh, I never even covered. My voice is one that you're likely not to encounter in this city, at least not this go around. That's right, this one's gonna have another campaign coming in the future. Any player that survives this journey is more than welcome to continue on the next go around, or they could let their character become an NPC, choosing a whole new one to begin with. I hope you enjoy the stakes of this new world, and look forward to seeing me in the second go around. The question for you to wonder now, Am I going to be the only familiar face? Or is someone else going to manage to make it through to the end? Best of luck, you gunks.